You know, not so long ago, I was a defeated man, hiding in a cave, watching this uh, spider moving back and forward, back and forward, building his web. And no matter how many times it failed, he never gave up. Well, inspired by that spider, the next day, I went out of that cave and I made myself a swing. <laughs> oh, don't get me wrong. Panic burn was a blast. Hey, hey, hey. Warrior poets, they called us. That's because we would hit them with rhyming couplets before smashing our skulls with axes. Then the next day we just, we all got on our bus, we went up to our growth. <laughs> so I was going to make a declaration. I was like this. Ho! Oh. <laughs> says, as long as but 100 of us remain alive, never will we submit to English rule. For it is in truth, not for glory, nor honour, nor riches that we are fighting, but for freedom, that which no honest man gives up, but with life itself. Then we got steamboats, we just wrecked the place. <laughs> I mean, what a night. What a night. I mean, I was a bit of a boy back in the day. I mean, I was, I was, I mean, I was like a chip. I mean, I, you heard of the Red Common, right? I, I'm the man, I swear. I, that was me. Done a minute in a chapel, my man. In a cha right in front of the altar. Ah, excommunicated for that, mate. I mean, that's deep, that's like. That's hellfire for all eternity. <laughs> and that. <laughs> and then, after years of arguing with the church, I've ended up, I just, I wrote to the Vatican, and I goes, look, can he cope? Nay, he hope. Can we stop all the rope I dope with the Pope? <laughs> and he goes, aye, all right. And, uh, and that was me at Tim again. <laughs> 